and Blind are working on a special project that will be on display in downtown Great Falls. And Tia Tamarco Tamarco tells us who's helping these students create works of art. I was thrilled when they contacted me. Cynthia Weitzel is a visual artist based out of Red Wing, Minnesota. I always enjoy the opportunity to connect with young people from our community. But what makes Weitzel unique is that she is representing the deaf community through her art. Most of them. They've never met or, or socialized with, with a deaf artist. And then when I show them my work, different examples of my art, they're all just fascinated. And Weitzel is using her skills to guide these children to make a found object sculpture. When I flew in on Tuesday, I started immediately to go all over the place searching for things to, to find, specifically that I would felt would, would fit well visually for this project. Weitzel says these kids are also learning about commitment, patience, and focus as they are putting the piece together. So right now it doesn't make sense because <laughs> we're just in the beginning stages, not normal that you just sit down and paint or draw. Weitzel says it will be bright and full of color. It will also have strong symbolism of the deaf community throughout it. Well, I really appreciate that desire to have exposure of deaf professionals in various fields. Weitzel says this is a great opportunity for the deaf and hearing community to understand each other. This is an awesome opportunity for this to happen. In Great Falls, Margaret DeMarco, NTN News. Another project will be on display from June 5th until September 5th in downtown Great Falls.